We're following some breaking news for you in Waterbury right now, where crews are on the scene of a large fire right on Collie Street. The area is very active right now. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Matt McFarland is live on the scene. Matt, what can you tell us? Just to give you an idea of where we are, it's Collie and Robin Street. It's right across from Waterbury Hospital, the entrance to Waterbury Hospital. I'm going to step out of the way. Uh, an intense scene. Uh, firefighters, they've been here uh, for about two hours battling this fire. Uh, I got the call around 10 o'clock. Uh, quickly see uh, flames and smoke sort of coming from this large building right here. Fire chief tells us it's a 12,000 square foot uh, mixed use building. So there's uh, 12 units up top. There's a mini mart grocery store at the bottom. Uh, so again, we spoke to a number of residents telling us one man telling us he was in his unit. All of a sudden it's here sort of like some popping sound. And then all of a sudden flames coming into his unit. Uh, he got a, a, a person who was there in his room. Everybody rushed out down the stairs. They described it as heavy smoke, heavy fire, sort of chasing them. We also spoke with another man who lived in the back. Uh, he said he couldn't get out. There was no way he could get out with the, with the flames and the smokes. He actually went out his window. There was a pole nearby. He said he sort of shimmied down the pole and eventually uh, was able to jump down uh, from about the second floor down. Um, and he basically said now he's lost everything. All he has is the clothes on his back. He said he didn't even have a pair of shoes on when he got out. Uh, so again, we're told about 35 people live in this unit right here. Uh, the fire quickly spread from this building also to a multifamily home next door. We're told a total of 35 folks live here. Uh, everyone's accounted for except one person. So the fire chief tells us uh, they are looking, but uh, basically it's been sort of a, uh, an exterior attack uh, using multiple uh, aerial units, ladder trucks, uh, fighting from the outside. Uh, and uh, the fire chief tells us they expect to hear expect to be here for a long part of the day. He said, we're going to be here all day uh, as they uh, sort of try to get this fire out under control and then begin their investigation into just what caused this fire. We're live with the Mobile Newsroom in Waterbury. Matt McFarland, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. All right. Thanks, Matt.